The agriculture and food production industry employed more than one billion people as of 2013. That's about a third of the global workforce. While the industry is substantial, a relatively small number of companies wield an enormous amount of influence. According to a report by Oxfam International, Behind the Brands, these are the 10 companies that control the world's food. Swiss-based Nestle comes in first with $103.5 billion in revenue reported in 2013. Unilever Group is a UK and Netherlands-based company that makes food products as well as personal and home care products. They reported a revenue of $68.5 billion. In addition to owning famous soda brands such as Pepsi and Gatorade, PepsiCo Inc. also controls food brands such as Tostitos, Doritos, and Quaker, and employed nearly a quarter of a million people at the end of 2013. Coca-Cola is among the most valuable brands in the world. In total, sales for the company were nearly $47 billion. A split off from Kraft Foods in 2013, Mondelez International owns several candy brands which include Cadbury, Nabisco, Oreo, and Trident, among others. The company has more than $35 billion in revenue and more than $72 billion in assets at the end of 2013. Mars Inc. owns several well-known chocolate brands such as M&M's and Snickers, but they also own a wide range of food brands such as Uncle Ben's Rice and chewing gum maker Wrigley. With $29.3 billion in revenue, France's Group Danon has markets in Russia, the U.S. and China and is one of the world's largest sellers of early life nutrition. Associated British Foods has revenues in excess of $21 billion. The UK-based company operates sugar factories, sells food ingredients to wholesale and industry customers, and manufactures consumer products such as Mazzola corn oil and Twinings tea. General Mills owns some of America's best-known brands including Betty Crocker, Green Giant, and Pillsbury. They reported revenue of $17.9 billion. Among the top food companies, Kellogg is the smallest by revenue, reporting $14.8 billion.